Plant friends, welcome to a planty bathroom. Bloom and grow, YouTube show. Friends, um, today's episode of the Bloom and Grow YouTube show is going to be a little different because we're doing botanically based skincare, and I'm so lucky to be in this very botanical bathroom. We've got this wacky fun plant and then if we scope down oh, check out this monstera that my friends have i'm currently in dc so for those of you that listen to the podcast you know that this month's one of the amazing podcast sponsors that we have is osea malibu which is botanically inspired skincare so planty skincare all of their products are derived from organic patagonian seaweed which is plants it's skincare that's non-toxic, cruelty-free, vegan, derived from plants. So like what better podcast partner than that for Bloom and Grow Radio. So I figured um, that I would show you the skincare routine that I've been doing using the Osea products um, because clean beauty is actually something that's really important to me. You haven't really heard me talk about it on the podcast. Um, it is plant-based though and about three years ago, I, have, I developed really bad rosacea in my 20s and three years ago, I decided to clean up my skincare and my makeup. So now I use predominantly all clean beauty, all non-toxic beauty products, and I've seen a real difference in my skin. So right now, it, it was 91 degrees in DC today. I have so many layers of dried sweat on my skin and a couple of makeup applications, but what better to show you like what my normal makeup routine would look like or my makeup removal. And speaking of makeup removal, if you stay tuned to the end of the episode, I am going to show you what my cat's makeup looks like and how I take that off using all non-toxic clean beauty products with Osea. So kind of a fun, unique episode for Blue and Grow. So first comes first, speaking of cats, we gotta get ready, gotta get all my hers out of my face. <laughs> how cute is this? So, um, I just use, I'm not a fancy skincare person, so I've tried other skincare routines where it's like 10 steps and I just like get tired. <laughs> I'm tired at the end of the day. But the thing that I love about this program I've currently got with Osea, it's a couple of really nice products that are like luxurious. My skin feels amazing when I go to bed and when I wake up in the morning, but it's really not that difficult. And for me, low maintenance skincare is really important because I am a little bit of a low maintenance plant parent and a low maintenance skincare person. So let's begin. Now it's gonna get messy before it gets good. So the first product of theirs that I'm gonna use, I love their um, makeup remover. I feel like my I have really sensitive eyes and I love obviously wearing makeup. I've got that liquid liner going on. Um, and a lot of those like micellar waters like really aggravate my eyes. So I use their, um, can you see that? This is how the YouTubers do it, right? <laughs> Um, so this is their argan oil. So I'll use this twice. So I actually use the argan oil to take my eye makeup off and I wear a lot of lip stains so I'll take my lip off with it um, and then I'll go in with the cleanser and then I'll use it again as moisturizer. So if I'm really low maintenance and really tired, I will literally roll this on my eyeball but today for you guys, my plant friends, I'll put it on my eyes and I'm just literally gonna become a raccoon. I'm gonna get in there. How do I look? Do I look so like cool doing this? Oh yeah, look at me go. Um, so I just get in there and I'll do a little like this on my lips. Okay, then I'm gonna take their Ocean Cleanser and I'm gonna go rinse my face, get some of the this eye makeup off and then go in with their Ocean Cleanser and I'll be right back. is one of the best smelling products I have ever used. This smell, it's lime, cypress, juniper, and something else. The smell is like unlike anything I've smelled before in any sort of product. And I find myself just wanting to like massage it into my skin <laughs> because it smells so good. And it's all natural scents because these products are all natural. <sighs> <laughs> so um, one other thing about the cleanser, it smells amazing. It's got the Patagonian seaweed in it. 
Um, it leaves my skin feeling obviously like completely clean of makeup. Um, but my skin doesn't feel stripped and I used to be really into these like super foaming cleansers that I felt like really like ripped everything off my skin because I liked that feeling. Um, so adjusting to something that isn't as foamy like was a bit of an adjustment, but I really like how my skin You can see that my rosacea isn't very Activated and normally when I have washed my skin with foaming cleanser like my I have like a red panel, so The cleanser is definitely of all the Osea products my favorite thing <laughs> like I can't say enough great things about it I just my skin does not feel stripped right now it feels clean you can see it took off like pretty much all of my um, eyeliner and that oil that I used is gone so that's amazing so next stop is the Osea sea minerals mist also you can hear that little ASMR um, all of their packaging, all of their bottles are glass. There are these, which like makes it look so high end and beautiful, um, but also like good for the environment. So they are really like sustainably, um, they have a huge sustainability mission, uh, which you can read more about in the link in the show notes. But um, yeah, so then I go in with the Sea Minerals Mist. Like I said, I have sensitive eyes, so I spray it on my hands and I rub it and go like this. So if you wanted to, if you don't have sensitive eyes, you could literally just do, 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 do. that's like what most of the girls I see on YouTube doing. But I just noticed that sometimes if I spray it and it gets in my eyes, my eyes get really aggravated. Also, the other thing is my new favorite um, guilty pleasure is Vogue uh, has a YouTube series called Beauty Secrets, and they have all of these different like models and famous actresses like do their skincare routine. And I kind of feel like that's what I'm doing for you, but that's really stupid because I am not a skincare expert. This is just my botanically inspired skincare that I like. But anyway, all of the models and the actresses say that you have to pat the product into your skin and not rub it. So I've been trying that. I've been working with that. So next up, we're going to go back to the oil. And I'm going to put a very thin layer of the oil on my skin. And I do this only at night for extra moisture. Um, the one thing that... so. I've tried other beauty oils before and actually last week I tried this other beauty oil that I used to use all the time to compare it to this and I noticed that the other oil didn't absorb in my skin as well as this did and I found that the key with this is not to put too much so I just kind of rub the roller ball because you can see it's a little roller ball I rub the roller ball on my hands I get just a little bit and I press it into the areas of my skin that I know get really dry. So my nose, my lips, I love putting it on my lips, and I press it in, I'll like kind of get in there in the under eye region. I turn 30, I need to start paying attention to my under eyes. Um, and now I'm just gonna let this absorb a little bit more. So as you can see, I'm a little bit shiny now from the oil, but if you, the longer you leave it to absorb the more, but you can also, you can already tell that the oil is starting to get absorbed into my skin. So I do the oil, then my second favorite, I mean, all of these, I love all of these products, but first, my first favorite product is the um, cleanser because like it's my favorite smelling product I've used. And also I feel like it gets the, it, it teeters that perfect, like removing all the makeup but not stripping my skin. The Atmosphere Protection Cream, I love. Another fun thing that I love about Osea, as I've gotten to know the women who started this company, is it's a women, a family of women who started the company. Um, they're awesome and they are inspired, the whole company is inspired by the four elements. So it's ocean, sun, earth, and atmosphere. And this is the Atmosphere YouTube. This is the Atmosphere Protection Cream. So I use this as a moisturizer at night, but more importantly, and the intention of the product is, it's an atmosphere protection cream. So it should be like the first thing you put on in the morning, and it's obviously non-toxic, all natural. It's got all of the amazing properties from the seaweed. So I view it when I put it on in the morning as like my barrier to going outside, air pollution, the makeup that I might put on my face, sunscreen, other more, other products. It's like a great primer. And in cats, which you will see later in the episode, I use this as my primer for the crazy cats makeup as well. So I'll do like two little tabs and I'll put this on top of the oil and I'm dabbing. 
I feel so fancy when I pat. I feel like those really fancy supermodels, plant friends. And this is my skin. This is my skincare routine. Four times a week-ish, I do a mask, especially depending on how many times I'm in cats. Um, I love the white algae mask. YouTube. I love the white algae mask. Um, this is super moisturizing and it's actually a mask you can leave on your face overnight to like really enhance your moisture and also it really helps with my redness because um, I am epic, I have epic rosacea. Um, so this is one that I use a couple of times a week and then if you aren't as sensitive, um, the red algae mask that they have has clay in it and it's a real one of those masks that it dries you can feel it kind of tightening on your skin and then you wash it off. And I'll use that like once a week um, to get any like makeup or residue or weird stuff that I have lying around in my skin. So, oh, another thing that I like to do, I bought this at TJ Maxx for $4 because my friends told me to and I go like this, oh yeah. Mm-hmm. And I go like this and I go like this. And I feel so fancy when I do it. It's supposed to help your skin absorb the creams and I think it's like good for circulation or something. Once again, this isn't a makeup YouTube channel. This is a planty YouTube channel with planty skincare, but why the hell not to show you. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath, plant friends. So this is my evening routine. In the morning, I will wash with the cleanser. I will spritz and pat with the mist and then I will put the atmosphere cream on. I will not use the oil. I will put the atmosphere cream on, let it absorb before I uh, put my sunscreen on or put my makeup on um, and use it as a primer. So that's this is a very easy botanical skincare routine. If you are just looking to up your game, if you're looking to go non-toxic, go Clean Beauty. Osea is a wonderful company. You can learn more about them by clicking the link in the show notes and they are giving $10 off to your first order of $50 or more for Bloom Girl listeners. All the information is in the show notes. If you wanna stick around, I'm gonna show you my cat's prep makeup and all natural cats stage makeup removal. So I'm going to look a little bit different. <laughs> okay, plant friends. So I showed you my all natural skincare routine that I do at night and how to take my makeup off. And now I'm going to show you how I've been using Osea to create a non-toxic, cruelty-free, vegan, clean beauty routine for the incredible, insane cat's makeup that I do. So we know that I put this primer on in the morning under my makeup. I do the same thing um, before I get into cat, which is what we call it. Um, I'll be Jelly Lorem tonight. So this is gonna be the barrier, um, a, a nice barrier to all of the aggressive stage makeup that I'm gonna put on. It has shea butter in it, avocado oil, um, and algae, which is all like protective and moisturizing. It's so moisturizing and it smells so nice. It has lavender and geranium in it. So I've prepped my skin with this. Um, I've let it just kind of absorb a minute and now I'm going to get into full cat. So here we go. <laughs> So this is me as a cat. I have my lashes on, I have my makeup on, time to go get my spandex on um, and my wig. Fun fact, the wigs are made of yak hair. Um, and I'll see you after the show to take it all off. plant friends the show is over um i have removed my eyelashes because nobody needs to see me take peel my eyelashes off it's my least favorite part of the entire show um so i've got all this cuckoo makeup on let's take it off in an all natural non-toxic vegan cruelty free way that comes from seaweed this is what i've been doing on tour every time i've gone on for the last couple of months and it's just my skin is very thankful for it. Um, okay, so the key with stage makeup that's this intense is you need some sort of oil base to like get in there. 
Um, so the all natural version is coconut oil. We use um, the other performers use something called hydro oil. So you get the oil going, you mush all the makeup off. So I'm gonna turn gray before, <laughs> before it comes off. And then you go in with a cleanser um, and, and get the rest of it off. So we've got coconut oil. So well, first what I'm gonna do is take the argan oil, the Osea argan oil, and I'm just gonna put this only on my eyes because my eyes are sensitive and the thickest makeup that we use is on our eyes. So since my eyes are sensitive, oh, I look so beautiful, look at that. I'm gonna do that. Then I'm gonna go in with some coconut oil and Osea has two different cleansers. One that is much creamier than the other. Um, and that cleanser I mix with the coconut oil because it's creamier. It's the Ocean Cleansing Milk. And I find that I start with that. So even though I use, every day I use their Ocean, only their Ocean Cleanser. Whoops. Woo! <laughs> I, I don't use this milk as frequently so it gets a little stuck. So you put the milk and oil in your hands. I look like a raccoon. And now the key is to get into your skin and mush it all up. And basically the key is to make your face the most unattractive color possible. And then you know that you're, you're doing it right. So now I'm gonna rinse this off and then I'm gonna go back in with the Osea Cleanser, my favorite product that they make, and go in and strip everything else off. So stay tuned. <music> Okay, so for take one, that's done a pretty good job at getting most of it off. Then I'm gonna take the Osea Cleanser, which is my favorite product that they make. This thing smells unbelievable. It's got lime, cypress, and juniper in it. This is gonna go in and take all the rest of the makeup off. And <laughs> you have to make sure to get your neck because with cats, we have to put the makeup all the way down to our neck. And as you can see, the makeup is still like, the cleanser will like continue to kind of change the color of the makeup. The biggest part is the eyes. And now I'm gonna wash this off. Boom, plan friends, I don't got makeup on anymore. <laughs> So this has pretty much gotten it off. If I have, if I'm like going out that night, you'll see I'll, I'll have makeup glue. I'll be peeling makeup glue out of my eyelashes for the next two days. Um, if I wanna like really get rough with it, I'll put the argan oil back on my eyelids if I need to, um, to take some more makeup off because sometimes it's just hard to get with whatever product you use, whether it's clean or not, um, getting your eye makeup off can be really difficult. And then I prep my skin because obviously it's just gotten scrubbed to death. So I'm gonna put, just like I did last night, the Sea Minerals Mist. I'm gonna spritz it into my hand because it hurts my eyes when I spritz it on and pat it into my skin. So this moisturizes the skin um, and it also prepares my skin to absorb all of the other things I'm gonna put on it. So if I have to do another show, I'm gonna put the atmosphere cream and um, I'm gonna put the atmosphere cream on and then redo my makeup. But if not, since it's the end of the night and I'm going home, I'm gonna hit myself with a little bit of the argan oil on my nose my cheeks and my forehead where I get so dry. I'm gonna let this absorb. Oh, it always feels so nice to take off your kitty cat makeup at the end of the day. I love that I'm like crouching in. <laughs> if you guys could only see my filming setup right now. And then I'm gonna go in with the atmosphere cream and pat it into my skin to cool everything down. Don't forget your neck. And there you have it. I don't have any makeup on anymore. <laughs> so obviously my rosacea is a little bit inflamed just because I've been like scrubbing my face, but I find that the rosacea calms down a lot faster when I use this non-toxic stuff. I'm so thankful to Osea for making these products. Yeah, I hope this serves as inspiration that you can, no matter what type of makeup you are taking off, make it non-toxic 
make it clean, um, and seriously try the Osea stuff out. They're offering $10 off for your first purchase of $50 or more. All of the links and details are in the show notes below. Until next time, plant friends, keep blooming and keep growing. Mm -hmm.